This is the world of the Star Kingdom. The world was a safe haven, a beautiful place where every Pokemon of every type could live together in peace and harmony. However, the kingdom wasn't always so peaceful. The Shadow Era was a time when the land was cloaked in darkness, crawling with shadowed entities known as corruptions. These beings had glowing red eyes and a black, inky figure, able to take the form of any Pokemon. They destroyed and terrorised the beauty of the world. The one behind such a calamity was an evil overlord who conjured and controlled the corruptions to wreak havoc upon the land. When all hope was lost and the subjects of the kingdom felt they were doomed to live under his malicious reign forever, the blackened sky dazzled with the light of a thousand falling stars, and from the radiance materialised a glistening ethereal being. In its paw it raised an artefact in the shape of a star, its shards sparkled with the spectra of ten hues. Using the star's ancient magic, the goddess banished the corruptions and encased the overlord in stone, removing his gem, sealing his magic inside, setting the kingdom free from his reign of terror. The being came to be known as Queen Spectria, who maintained balance and watched over the kingdom as a noble ruler. Every ten years since the kingdom's restored peace, a luminous star shower occurs, which not only recharges the kingdom's magic through the star, but acts as a symbol of peace, which awakens festivities and celebrations all across the land. However, after a few centuries, Queen Spectria grew weak from trying to maintain her physical form, while simultaneously upholding the Rainbow Star's magic. As a result, she gave life to two princess daughters who inherited her cosmic powers so that when they came to an age of responsibility, they could continue the legacy of supporting and caring for the kingdom. The queen, now comforted that the princess sisters could care for the kingdom, renounced her physical form and became a guardian spirit so that she may eternally balance and recharge the magic of the Rainbow Star. And that is why we celebrate the Rainbow Star Festival every 10 years. <laughs> oh, what a nice day it is today! I can't wait for the festival later! Hey, Evie! Silver, what have I told you about sneaking up on me like that? Sorry, there are just too many great hiding places. Are you excited for tonight? Of course, it's going to be so great! You know what? Let's head over to the castle now! Maybe we can help with some of the festival preparations! Silver! Wait for me! You know I can't run as fast as you! Come on, Evie! Quickly! <laughs> Another day, another successful gemstone heist. I must simply be the greatest, most astonishing criminal genius in the entire kingdom. At least now I finally have some peace and quiet to continue my studies. Hmm. Is in there. What a peculiar gemstone. It seems to be pointing towards something. Wait! What if it's leading me towards more priceless gems? Ancient treasures! Here I come!
Whatever this strange gemstone is leading me towards, I must be quite close. Wait, what? Oh, that's a dead end! That is a waterfall. There is no possible way I can get through that. What? Oh my goodness! Uh, okay. Never mind. What is this place? I don't see any gold, diamonds, or treasure. Count dazzle weather. What? Who said that? I know that you wish to be respected and praised by the kingdom. The reason you steal all those riches in the first place is to give you that feeling of power and authority, which you desperately strive. I don't know what you are, or what you want, but how do you know this? I know and I see everything. I also know that you have a seemingly perfect younger brother by the name of Sir Cedric. He was knighted by the princesses for his dutiful and noble works. He always seems to outshine you. Doesn't he? You don't know anything about me! You don't know who I am! Oh, but I do. I'm not wrong when I say you would do anything to gain power. If you help me, I can make you someone extraordinary. You will have powers greater than anyone in the kingdom. Hmm. What? Do I need to do? Place the gems. Delightful to be back. Who are you? Why, where are my manners? Not introducing myself after being absent for 500 years. <laughs> my name is Lord Melission. 